literally cannot convey how terrible I am at starting videos. I always like take about seven videos of me being like, hi, how are you? And they all seem very disingenuine. So let's just start the video with no greeting. <laughs> nothing all day. I have a day off and instead of you know living my best life I'm just sitting here doing nothing and while I was sitting here doing nothing I started thinking about right after I published my first book The Last Air happens to be right on my lap I made a quiz on BuzzFeed and the quiz was which character from The Last Air am I? Now I published The Last Air uh, like a year and a half ago or pretty close to that I think and I found this quiz, totally forgot I made it, and I don't really remember which characters correspond to which questions. So I thought it would be fun if I took the quiz, because I don't really remember like what question goes with what character, it'll just be my legitimate answers to the questions, and find out what character am I really like from the last era. People ask me this all the time, they're like, one of your characters has to be a self-insert summer. Who is it? Who is it? And I'm I, like, I don't, don't base any characters directly off myself because no one would want to read a book about, believe me, no one would want to read a book where I'm the main protagonist because I'm boring. But I personally think if I had to choose a character that I am most like for my book, I would probably go with Alita because I too have no idea what's going on at any time of the day or night. I'm completely clueless and I feel like Alita's kind of clueless as well. But today we will find out the actual answer because I am taking the official what character from the last air am I. I will link the quiz below so you also can figure out that very important piece of information. Which character are you most like? So also before we get into it, go pre-order my third book, The Gatekeeper. Link is in the bio. It's already out on Kindle, so if you want to get started to it, literally like right after you finish watching and liking this video and subscribing to my channel, you can. I'll link that too. So okay. here we go. I'm going to put myself to the side a little, and I'll put every question up here so you can see what I'm dealing with. Question number one. What is my go-to hobby? Pissing off my family. Fun, but not a hobby. Martial arts. I've always wanted to get into it but I have not. Spending time by myself, working, studying, reminiscing about happier times. Okay, I'm already starting to get a feeling of which characters are which, but before I like dive into it, I'm just gonna go subconsciously off the top of my head, my hobby would be spending time by myself because I do that a lot. And I feel like most of my hobbies are within, hobbies are within spending time by myself. So I'll be by myself and I read, watch TV, play guitar, whatever. So spending time by myself is the answer. What is my dream job? Outdoorsman, anything despite my parents. I like my parents. So sailor, librarian, oh, that's obvious who it is for. Leader of a nation or detective. Right away, I gotta go with outdoorsman. I hate bugs, but out of the all those jobs, I definitely wouldn't want to be a sailor because I get seasick. Librarian, I think I would just be too, I'm too loud. Leader of a nation, absolutely not. And detective, I don't really like crime shows. So if I don't like crime shows, I'm sure I wouldn't like being a detective. So, outdoorsman. Ideal first date. I don't care as long as my family hates who I'm dating. I'm not gonna pick this one. A fancy dinner, a nature hike. I'm too heartbroken for my last relationship to think about dating. Sailing or horseback riding. I would have to go with horseback riding. I think that would be a really fun activity for a first date. What is your ideal vacation? Cabin retreat, somewhere with no people. Okay, same. I feel like those are the same two answers, but they're separate. Anywhere away from my family. Paris, Colorado, Boston. Um, I want to like combine three of these answers. A cabin retreat with no people in Colorado would be like my top answer, but I'm going to go with Colorado for that one. I've actually been there and I would love to go again. Pick a movie. Again, these are all movies that I like. Oh, I actually haven't seen The Revenant. I don't know why that's an answer. I wonder who it's for. Um, I'm gonna go with Pirates of the Caribbean though, out of those ones. I love that movie. What makes me angry? So much does. The wickedness of men, my family, being accountable for others' mistakes, power hungry men, everything being lied to. Many months, um, many moons ago, the answer to this would have been everything makes me angry. But I feel like I'm in a better space than I was those months ago. 
So I think I'm going to answer being lied to. I, I, that kind of makes me angry. Choose a band slash artist you would listen to. What's funny about this question is these are all artists I would probably listen to, but I just right off the bat have to go with Chris Stapleton because I've seen him in concert and I haven't seen any of these other people in concert. So Chris Stapleton it is, but honestly, I would love any of those, those bands. What song would you sing at karaoke? I definitely think that I would sing the Shania Twain song. I have sung it before. So this is a historically accurate answer is that Don't Impress Me Much by Shania Twain. I love karaoke. I don't know if it's something I've ever talked about here on my channel before. Karaoke is like my favorite thing in the entire world. Well, I love and it. I think I'm gonna love it more after January because I will be 21 and I feel like it'll just add another whole layer of fun to karaoke. So stay, stay tuned. I'll, I'll let you guys know. What is your favorite flavor of ice cream? Sea salt caramel. I don't deserve ice cream. Dark chocolate, strawberry, chocolate chip cookie dough, toasted s'mores. Chocolate chip cookie dough definitely takes the cake for that one. I was the kid who ate too much raw cookie dough as a like child, and that's probably why I write fantasy books instead of you know like go to college and get a good career and, and make money. But you know the raw cookie dough was pretty good. So all right, drum roll for what character I got, please. I don't think I have the drum roll sound effect on my YouTube editing thing, so everyone just imagine a drum roll. I got Atrial! Here is the um, little blurb. You are a strong yet mysterious warrior with a life situation you really didn't ask for. You try to make the best of what has been given to you and you have a sweet, sensitive, funny side that most people never see. You often find yourself in situations where everyone around you wants to beat the crap out of you, but most of the time you're bailed out. Um, okay. Just from an accuracy standpoint, um, for myself, I don't think I'm strong and I don't think I'm mysterious. I'm a very, like, I feel like there's no mystery about me at all. A life situation I really didn't ask for. Uh, all, all, my whole life situation is the result of decisions I've made, so I guess technically I did ask for them. So far, we're not doing good. You try to make the best of what has been given to you. That's true. I, I always try to make the best of things. And you have a sweet, sensitive, funny side that most, yeah, most people, people never, never see. see. Sweet, most people who know me would probably have to ax that adjective. Sensitive, yes. I am a very sensitive person. And funny, I, I mean, you guys have seen the videos on these channels. That's it's probably not, not a thing that most people never see. I... People, I pretty much am sensitive all the time around anyone, even strangers. And you often find yourself in situations where everyone around you wants to beat the crap out of you, but most of the time you're bailed out. I'm pretty sure everyone around me wants to beat the crap out of me, but they're not very, they, I think they secretly want to do it, you know, like they would never actually vocalize. Well, some have, From but what you've seen of this channel, I don't know. Do you think I'm like Gabriel? I, I don't know. I would like to know who you are though, so go take the quiz below and comment what last air character that you get and then comment like, did you think that's who you're gonna get? Who do you think you're the most like? It's really fun to do this and like compare and contrast like which traits of which characters. I feel like, like I need a, I really get, need a know? quiz where you can find out what like combination of characters you are. If I, cause if I had to pick a combination, I'm sure Adriel would be one of the ones I'm combined with. So I would probably say I'm a combination of Adriel, Alita, and, and Sani. But I don't know. What do you guys think? So go take the quiz below. Remember to like this video and subscribe and go pre-order my book or get it off Kindle. And I hope you love it. And I hope you love this video. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye!